Welcome, Farik. How was the how was the match? How did you enjoy? Well, um, if you can see my face, you know, uh, I'm not lying. I've been playing for 15 years. Um, I, I didn't expect this at all. You know, I, I, uh, this morning I I, I, I uh, run into a friend of mine at, at the airport. He played here last year, and I told him I'm going to Makaj. And he says, "Dude, be ready." You know, so. Uh, DJ life is, let's say, amazing, but what is the disadvantage of DJ life? This, this, I'm happy you asked that question because it's definitely a big part that people do not see. They uh, they look at Martin Garrix and uh, all of our Elton those guys, the big shops with the private jets and all that, which is great. It's not reality for a lot of guys like me and Joe Stone and all that. You know, uh, there's a lot, it's really lonely. I'm in my studio every day by myself. And I'm a pretty social guy, you know, I like people, but I'm all, always alone. I don't have a tool manager, so I'm always alone on the flights. Every experience you have in different countries is by yourself. Um, so let me make clear, I'm not, I'm not bitching about it. I'm super happy it's happening, but it's pretty lonely and, uh, the, you know, flying in, flying out. It, it, it's very cool to do it, but it's definitely a downside to it. And that's definitely that. Uh, I, I enjoyed working at IDT, Loveland, Armada Music for DJing with a lot of cool colleagues, people, like-minded people, uh, which is really great. So I, I definitely uh, realize the difference now. We, I really am super happy I'm doing this, but it's, I definitely miss having people in an office, you know, like-minded people. And that's, that's something that people do not really understand in a way. You know? Okay, Farik, so uh, hope to see you again in Czech Republic because you really kicked the night, I can say. And thanks for the interview. It was really a pleasure to meet you. Thank you so much. Thanks a lot.